Hi, this is from Groovy Entertainment. Today we got another book to read for you. Today's book is Thomas Saved the Day from 1989. So let's get started. Every day, Sir Topham Hatter came to the station to catch his chain. Hello, he always said to Thomas. Don't let the silly freight cars tease you. Remember, you have an important job as a special helper in the train yard. There were lots of freight cars, and Thomas worked very hard, pushing and pulling them into place. There was also a small coach and two strange things the driver called cranes that the breakdown train, he told, it, he told Thomas, the cranes are for lifting heavy things like engines and coaches and freight cars. One day, Thomas was in the yard. Suddenly, he heard an engine whistling. Help, help. A freight train came rushing through much too fast. The engine was James, and he was frightened. His brake block was on fire. They are pulling me. They are pulling me, he panted. On, on, laughed the freight car. So, whistling, help, help. Poor James disappeared. I like to teach the freight cars a lesson, said Thomas to think. Soon came the alarm. James is off the line. The breakdown train quickly. Thomas was coupled on and off. They went. Thomas worked his hardest. Hurry, 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 he puffed. He wasn't pretending to be like Gordon. He already meant it. Bother those freight cars and their tricks. I hope poor James didn't hurt. James Driver and Fireman was filling him all over to see if he was hurt. Never mind, James, they said. It was those silly freight cars and your old wooden brake that caused the accident. Thomas pushed the breakdown train along, sorry, alongside. Then he pulled away the unhurt freight cars. Oh dear, oh dear, they groaned. Serve you right, serve you right, puffed Thomas. He was hard at work, puffing backward and forward all afternoon. This'll teach, this teach you a lesson. This, I'll teach you a lesson, he told the freight car. And they answered, yes it will, yes it will. They left the Right. They left the broken car. Then then with two cranes, they pulled Jane back on the rail. He tried to move, but he couldn't. So Thomas helped him back on the shed. Sir Top Hat Hatter was waiting anciently for them. Well, Thomas, he said, I had heard all about it, and I am pr very pleased with you. You are really used. Well, you are a really useful engine. James should have some proper brakes in a new coat of paint, and you should have a right, and you should have a branch line all to yourself. Oh, thank you, sir," said Thomas. Now Thomas is as happy as he wait. Right, now Thomas is as happy as can be. He has a brake line and two coaches called Andy. Right. Annie and Carabell. He puffed proudly backward and forward with them all day. He had never lonely. Edward and Henry stopped quite often and tell him how right, and tell him the news. Gordon is always in a hurry, but never forget to say poop poop. And Thomas always whistled peep peep in return. <laughs> So that was Thomas Saved the Day from 1989. So if you like, subscribe, share, and comment. Have a great day with another video from that real soon.